Welcome to this YouTube channel guys. Uh, today we are going to look at uh, vulnerabilities that happened in databases especially when uh, you have a vulnerable storage for information that you are getting from users and here we are going to use the, uh, the SQL map. There is a tool called SQL map. If I go to my terminal here and write uh, SQL map uh, H uh, you find that this tool has different uh, uh, parameters that you can use in uh, doing uh, pen testing on the different databases so that at least you can identify different vulnerabilities enumeration dumping databases uh, data so today we are still going to use the same test uh, php vuln uh, web provided by acunetics uh, that we can use a little bit to see how you can get information that is stored on the different databases so to start with let's test for example finding database for example on the list products that are available on these uh, websites so i will go to browse categories and here you see that i have different categories of uh, uh, products that are in this uh, database so when i go for example to postures i have this and you can see the link that i've been given here so when i do for example copy this link copy the link and um, uh, I will I copy the link and just do SQL SQL map with the parameter of U U here if you look at U here uh, stands for um, URL uh, the target URL that uh, is being placed so that at least we can do an enumeration on it so to find the tables that are available here I'm going to paste in the URL and pass in the parameter for uh, tables. So if you look at here, we have the parameter for tables, enumerating the da database uh, model, uh, database tables. Uh, so when I click enter, uh, this is how uh, the enumeration takes place. You find that here, the um, the SQL map is able to give me the different database tables that are existing within this database of uh, uh, that is provided by uh, Acunetics. The database is called Acuart. So here we have how many tables? We have eight tables that are existing within this uh, uh, within this database. So let's say, for example, the one that might be of interest to us here might be maybe we want to use the one for artists or we want to use for uh, uh, the one which is uh, used for use uh, for the users. Because basically when you go into a database, you want to find uh, information, information for the users. Let us first of all look at uh, uh, the schema of this database. So. Let's take, for example, uh, within that link still, I pass in the parameter uh, parameter D. The parameter D in the in the SQL map stands for uh, stands for database, and then I will pass the name of uh, uh, the database the database name, and then uh, I will look at. Uh, the table we had the table here called artist we had the table called artist here i want to look at um who are the people who are available in this uh, table first of all let us look at its schema its schema is like the way it has been structured so i will look at it in terms of columns what are the columns that are existing in this database so if I do that, you find that these are the columns that are existing here. We have uh, the column and the type and the data type that is existing within database. So let's say, for example, the one that is uh, uh, more uh, uh, of interest here, I don't want to look at artist ID. I want to look at, for example, their name. And if, if in case this database was having, for example, usernames and password, if in case you are logging in into a vulnerable 
uh, website then you will find that sql map is able to at least give me the passwords and the usernames of each and every person within a vulnerable database so let's say for example i want to dump in the names of people who are existing within data this database let's say for example um here i am passing in the artist table and uh, in terms of columns uh, i'm passing in parameter c to denote column and especially the column that i'm interested with is the anem uh, uh, anem column and i pass in the parameter dump dump because when we look at um, when we look at uh, up here if i go up here you will find that uh, the dump here stands for dump database data table uh, entries or you can use this other parameter for dumping database table entries so that you can be able to see what exactly is it that is stored in this database so this enables you to be able to return a list of names of all artists in this database so when i click enter You find that these are the names that are existing for in inside this database and even if i move to uh, uh, the, the the vulnerable uh, database that is provided here and browse artists you will find that these are the names of the people who are uh, available in this database so basically sql map is a tool that enables you to be able to do an enumeration of database be able to take advantage of any uh, any vulnerability that is existing within databases so any person who is a database creator who is creating database must look at how do we escape the sql injections that can be given on a database so that at least you can be able to escape such kind of attacks so that users uh, data are secured within the database otherwise thank you and uh, subscribe uh, and stay tuned for more information on cyber security thank you